Hi, I'm Carl from Adobe. And I'm Kiki from New Tech. And we've come together today to show you a powerful new technology from New Tech that works great with Adobe Creative Cloud. You ever been in a situation where you're working on something, need to get review and approval, but getting that person up out of their chair, across the building and into your edit bay proves too difficult? <laughs> or do you waste a lot of time rendering video files and then posting them to the network, just waiting around for somebody to take a look at them? What if you could magically take what you're editing and send the output to any screen on the network within your building? That's exactly what New Tech NDI does. We're actually using it right here. I've got the New Tech NDI plugin for Creative Cloud installed on my laptop. And you can see here under the Mercury Transmit settings, I've got New Tech NDI output. Just by turning this on, clicking OK, and pressing play, I can watch it live on my screen here. So I'm running a free application called New Tech NDI Monitor. It runs both on the Mac and the PC. And as long as I'm on the same network as Carl, I can check out any of the different Adobe applications that he's working on. Yeah, just to be clear, there's no video hardware connecting these two systems. There's no special magic black boxes or anything else. This is all simply done with traditional networking and New Tech NDI. Uh, Kiki, I'm gonna go ahead and jump over to Adobe After Effects. I wanna show you a little motion graphic that I'm working on here. Okay. Uh, can you go ahead and take a look at that? But of course, and to do that, I'm gonna right click on the screen, and now I can see all the different Creative Cloud applications that he's running. So all I have to do then is select the After Effects, and boom, there it is. You can see how easy it is for two people to collaborate, regardless of the distance involved between them. That's right, Carl. Right now we're sitting side by side, but I could be anywhere as long as we're on the same network. I could be in a meeting in a conference room, or here in the break room, or even in another building. As long as I'm on the same network, I can connect to NDI sources. NDI works great in a live production environment as well. And there's no need for expensive BNC cables and video routing gear to set it up. It's actually pretty simple. It's true. I've replaced my laptop with TriCaster, our live production system, and I've connected it to the network with an Ethernet cable. And I've decided to take all three of the Creative Cloud applications from his laptop and bring them in as inputs into my TriCaster. So input one is the Premiere Pro timeline. Input two is After Effects, and input three is Character Animator. As someone who's run a lot of cables over the years for live switcher setup, that is really easy. It's a single Cat6 cable into the network, and you're good to go. It's true. So what I'd like to do now is let's take that Premiere Pro timeline and bring it right into our live production. All right, I'm going to roll this back to the beginning. Just give me a three, two, one count whenever you're you ready. You got it. So three, two, one. Excellent. So now we have your live timeline coming right into our live production environment without rendering it. And this is great. You know, if you have a breaking news story, boom, you don't have to wait for it to render. You can bring it right on in. Uh, if I choose to create this as a clip for my TriCaster, all I have to do then is click on the record button and I can save it as a clip as well. For motion graphics playback, the Adobe Creative Cloud video tools actually have a brand new motion graphics workflow that combines After Effects and Adobe Premiere Pro for really simple ease of use, and it works great in a live environment. I'm gonna go ahead and switch over to a different timeline here, and here I have an animated lower third graphic that was actually brought over from After Effects onto the Premiere Pro timeline, and I've customized it using the new Essential Graphics panel inside of Adobe Premiere. Without doing any changes to NDI, we're now feeding that into the TriCaster. Right, so TriCaster recognizes the NDI output from Premiere. I'm feeding it to our downstream keyer, and if you look at the program output on the TriCaster, I'm just gonna overlay that motion graphic now, coming live from Carl's laptop into the TriCaster. And that's great, you've got the lower third over the output from Adobe Character Animator. Now we haven't really talked about Adobe Character Animator yet, but this is an application that comes with Creative Cloud that lets you take 2D artwork from Photoshop or Illustrator and turn it into an animated puppet that you can then play out live on the air. In fact, Character Animator's already been used on several different broadcast network shows in North America. I'm gonna go ahead and turn my laptop over here and I'm gonna go ahead and turn on my webcam on my laptop 
So you can see we're actually tracking my webcam and that's actually making my character animate. So I can kind of wiggle my head around back and forth like this and you can see my mouth motions, you can see my eyebrows kind of wiggling along here. This is a full screen puppet that I have here. I've got an attached background, so you can just take this as an input into the TriCaster. But I'm gonna do something different here. I'm gonna send you a puppet with an alpha channel so that you can kind of control what's going on. Sure. Let me switch over to uh, this little guy here. And this guy actually, his head kind of tracks around. You can see as I'm moving around here. And Kiki, you wanna put this guy into some kind of an environment? I sure do. So in TriCaster, we have something called Live Set. Ah. And I am just going to bring him on in his own newscaster set here and make it the NDI channel. How's that? I'm super excited about how Adobe Creative Cloud and NewTek NDI can work together. And it's really easy to get started. All you have to do is go to newtech.com slash NDI for your free NewTek NDI toolkit. And there's a bunch of other NDI applications there as well. Well, thanks for watching.